All right, so here we are once again with another clothing haul, but this time it is fall edition. I got so many cool pieces, and as you guys know, I need to show you guys. It is just mandatory. Basically, this video is going to consist of all of my recent purchases, and like always, before we get into the video, here are my measurements, just in case you need them for reference. I did also want to thank Princess Polly for sponsoring today's video. If you guys want to skip to the Princess Polly haul, here is the timestamp. The first thing I wanted to show you guys is the one one purchase that I made that I'm most excited about. Look at how beautiful these are. I still cannot get over these. They are beautiful. So these are the Heaven and Dr. Martens collab. I needed to get the high top ones because I've been wanting high top Doc Martens for the longest time and I actually got these in the smallest size that they had. Enough about the shoes. You guys get the point. I'm obsessed. They were a 10 out of 10 purchase. Moving on. Now for some stuff that I got off of Depop. As you guys may or may not know, Depop is basically my main Main source for clothing basically where I make all of my clothing purchases anyways one of my most recent purchases was actually this super cute miss 60 collar top literally all of my favorite colors in one top it has this like pistachio green baby pink and like brown colors there's this like miss 60 logo at the very bottom I'm not kidding when I saw this I don't think I've ever bought anything that fast next I got the iconic star girl co lolo top it just looks so angelic like I love the flowiness at the bottom and the lace trim along the entire thing it just looks so flattering and it definitely exceeded my expectations I also can't get over the fact that the girl that sold this to me actually watches my videos and sent me the sweetest card Naomi if you're watching this just know I love you and I will be keeping your card forever next I noticed that I didn't have any cute dresses for the fall season a lot of the dresses I have are mostly for the summertime and I saw this one it's the cutest black and white like flat little mini dress and I don't know what it is about it that just gives me major fall vibes. I love this little tie that it has here at the front. I literally just got this in the mail a few days ago and I already wore it out literally yesterday and let me tell you this dress looks so cute paired with a red leather jacket. Exhibit A. Yup. All right next. Dun dun dun. Look at this. It is this gorgeous hysteric tank top with the coolest graphic on it. I can't get over this. It has these like cool blue stars all over the entire thing. And that's honestly what made me want to purchase this. I don't know what's with me and stars lately, but the idea of just having them on clothing makes me think that the clothing piece is a lot cooler than it probably is. Next, I came across this really cool top. It looks a little wonky when I'm holding it up, but I love the way it looks on me. As you guys probably know, I have a thing for mesh tops. I just feel so powerful in them. I feel like tops like this with cool sleeves are gonna be a huge trend this fall or just sleeves in general if you guys watch my videos then you have probably already seen me wearing this i actually purchased this a while ago and it is just this basic white top with this pink graphic of this woman on it this was actually one of the pictures that i took in it so now for some individual purchases that I've made from separate stores. One of them was from Free People. This is actually the first time that I've purchased anything from there. I saw that they had these super sick jeans. Y'all need to see this. You guys cannot tell me that these are not the coolest pants you have ever seen. Just look at this. These are the bag pockets of the jeans. Just imagine yourself wearing these. They are also flared at the bottom. And the only downside to these is that if you're a short person, then these are probably going to be way too long on you. I'm 5'2 and these just did not fit me right but it's not gonna stop me from wearing these because I'm just gonna put on some platforms and I'll be fine. I recently got this little crossbody bag. It reminds me a lot of the types of bags that I used to wear when I was younger. It is a Japanese brand but this indeed has become my new go-to bag. I love how it looks tiny but it actually fits so much. Like it has so many pockets. It has some on the side, on the back, on the inside and then on the inside it has more pockets. It's just perfect. It's almost as if it was made for me. Oops, hold on, pause. I forgot to show you guys that I actually purchased these 874 Dickies pants recently as well. I've been needing a basic pair of pants in my closet and these were just it. The main thing I love about these pants is the fact that you can fold them over and they just look 10 times cooler. I did get them in the smallest men's size, but they were still a little long on me. Probably gonna have to tailor them, but other than that, I'm obsessed. All right, so now we're gonna be moving on to the Princess Polly haul. I wanna say that 40, 
30, maybe even 50% of my closet is made up of Princess Polly clothing. If I could only have one brand in my closet for the rest of my life, it would most likely be Princess Polly. If you guys didn't already know, Princess Polly does ship within the United States. They do offer free express shipping, which is three to four days to the US on all orders over $50. Princess Polly also offers afterpay and shop pay to all US customers. And you guys can also use my code ADELAXO for 20% off your Princess Polly order. So one of the first things that I have here is the prettiest green like flowy dress. This is the type of dress that makes me feel like a fairy. I would definitely wear this to like a picnic. I would definitely wear this dress with a little cardigan thrown over since the weather now is getting colder. Next I got the cutest little top with this like ring in the middle and it's also like cut and I actually already wore this top out. I took pictures in it. I love this blue color. It is so gorgeous. The style of this top reminds me of something that my mom probably wore in the 90s. In that same outfit, I wore this skirt that was also from Princess Polly. You guys are probably like, really? Another jean skirt? I know. I literally get a new jean skirt in every haul video, but hear me out. Okay, this one's different. It's not your average jean skirt. It has this like cute little crossover moment going on here. Next, I got my hands on two dresses. One of them has this magazine graphic on it. I've been really into clothing pieces that have really cool graphics like this on them, but this dress for some reason just really caught my attention. This little black lace trimming along the top really just elevates the look so much more. Then the other dress that I got is just a simple baby blue little lacy dress. The style of this dress gives me major pretties vibes. I love the soft and thick material of this dress. It just makes me want to sleep in it. Next, I did want to get my hands on a few basics, so I actually got this little brown bra top thing. Can't really tell if this is a bra or if it's supposed to be a top. Don't really care because I'm gonna wear it as a top anyways. I love throwing on bras like this under my sweaters and just wearing it as a top and calling it a look. Then next, I got this basic black top with this really cool graphic on the back of a bunch of lips. I can already see myself wearing this with a cute little cargo skirt. And these are the types of tops that you just need to have in your closet because they're basic but still really cute and they go with anything. I was so excited when I saw this on the Princess Polly website. I was like, I need to have this in my closet. It is this gorgeous brown crochet skirt. I could definitely see myself wearing this on like a beach day. One of the last things I got was this bright orange top and I don't really own that many orange clothing pieces. I don't ever really go for super bright clothing in general. So this was definitely out of my comfort zone. I wanted to try something new. I thought this like orange color was like really pretty and very fitting for the fall season. And I just thought this top would look really cute with some like brown trousers or something. Then I have yet again, another mesh top. It has this funky animal print all over the entire thing. And I just love the auburn color of this. The tight fit that it has makes this top so much more flattering. And I just know it's gonna look super cute with like a black mini skirt. Oh, and I almost forgot this sweater that I'm wearing is also from Princess Polly. It is this like black and white striped little sweater. I've been super into stripes recently for some reason. I don't know why. I did also get this in a size bigger because I wanted it to have that like oversized fit. Then the last thing that I got was just this oversized waffle knit beige sweater. I love these types of sweaters. I wear these way more often than I should, honestly. I just throw them on all the time when I go to sleep, when I'm going to go to the grocery store really quickly. So I decided to get this beige one because this would go with a lot more outfits. It's super soft and cozy and honestly, don't even question me if you see me wearing this in all of my upcoming videos. But uh, yeah. I think that was everything. I'm going to be ending the video here now. I hope you guys enjoyed. I know it's been a while since I posted a haul. I've been trying to slow down on the clothing haul videos because I kind of hate encouraging myself to purchase more clothing than I should. If you guys watched my recent closet clean out, then you probably know what I'm talking about. I would say that this haul was definitely on the smaller side compared to all of my previous clothing haul videos on my channel. So I'm definitely very proud of that. And I've come a long way. Trust me, I've had way too many moments in the past few weeks where I impulsively just wanted to buy clothing that I knew I didn't need. So I stopped myself and I let enough time pass by to realize that there were so many clothing pieces that I did not need that I didn't end up buying. I'm definitely gonna try to get back on the fashion content because I've slowed down on that within the past few months, but we'll see. And that is all. Love you guys very much and bye!
Also, Moose didn't make an appearance in this video. You guys need to say hi. Let me go get him. Say hello!